It's Kat here from a very special podcast, and I have an unboxing today. I finally, finally got my cause box for summer of 2020. It is August 17th, 2020. I've been waiting on this bad boy for forever. I've been watching like the welcome boxes, intro boxes, whatever go out, and this, just waiting for weeks, it said, awaiting shipment and I'm like what the heck I finally like emailed I was like when is this coming and I checked I ordered this in May so I would expect just from my experience with other seasonal boxes like you order you put the order in in like May and then like maybe a month later maybe a month and a half depending on like other stuff but still right right okay so we are gonna open up this bad boy we are gonna see if I think this is worth it. I ordered I ordered this when the spoiler for the PMD cleaner came in, and I was like, "That's it." I've been I was like hemming and hawing for a while, like, "Should I get this box? Is it something I want to like check out?" Because you guys know I love me some Fab Fit Fun, but I saw this. I was like, "Ooh, this is a good maybe point to." jump in try out the box and we shall see if I like it I mean it's pretty packaging I like that it didn't come in another box I didn't order anything extra I just ordered this box and with FabFitFun I almost always order extra so it comes in a bigger box but we shall see shall we I got my little partner in crime Sophia Potrillo nearby she's staring at me she's gonna let me know if I'm extra so first, let's open this puppy up. It's taped up at the bottom, so that's good. Nice and secure there. And on the side. So I'm not gonna show you the bottom because that's where my address is. And I don't need any crazies in my life more than I already have, you know? Okay. Okay. It's a pretty box. It'll look nice with all of my FabFit fun boxes I use for all kinds of other stuff. We have the booklet. This is heavier duty paper than what Fabs of Fun comes in. So we just check this out. It looks kind of like it's the same sort of thing. So, okay. We will, just, blah, blah, blah. we will see as if I don't speak for a living or anything. It's got a cute little sticker right there. This girl totally might just, because she's cute. Looks like she's reading a book. I can't tell quite what she's doing. I might just try to save that if I can. If I don't rip this right now, I'll put it in my planner. Yeah, guys, this is love. This is real life. Okay, I did not rip that. That's cool. Okay. There is a postcard. Uh, I don't send very much mail. I just don't but it's cute. I might just put that in my planner because you guys know I love me my planner. So let us see what we got because at this point I don't even remember what was like in the box. You know what I mean? Like it's been that long. Okay. First up I see are these stretch bullets. Oh my god. These are going to be so handy. Oh my god. These I'm excited about. Okay, I have scissors here. Cat, use the scissors. I'm just kind of clip it so that I don't cut into the actual silicone. Okay. Okay, so I have the silicone lids that are like stretchy so they can go over different things. This is going to be good. These are going to be good. I'm down with that because. I, I am terrible at plastic wrap. Unless I get the actual like press and seal plastic wrap, it doesn't stick. I don't know how cling wrap works, but it doesn't work for me. So these will be good. And yeah, that I'm cool with. Oh, yes, okay, I remember seeing this and this was like an item you may or may not get and it's the earrings and yes, I got them. I was kind of hoping I would get these. So I'm super, super excited for these. They're so cute. And I think 
Oh yeah, this is my style. This is my style. It's, I don't know what my style is, but this, this is it. This is going to be cool. Okay, okay. Yes, now I, I'm starting to remember now the Reed Diffuser. I'm down with that. It's bergamot and grapefruit. Ooh, that's going to be perfect. I actually just told my boyfriend this morning I was going to get him some grapefruit essential oil. So if I put this out, so like this is super simple. It's just like you open it and you put the reeds in. Yeah, that's all you're going to do. Every diffuser provides clean water to, to places that need it most. Okay, I'm guessing that's like when you buy one of these. So yes, I'm going to set that up probably here in my living room. It's just funny to me, like I just this morning told my boyfriend I was going to get him some grapefruit essential oil for some stuff. So that is awesome. Okay, what next? I have Healing Balm from Dr. Rogers Restore Healing Balm. Use, uses chapped lips, cuts, burns, severe dry and sensitive skin, post-procedure skin care, beauty hacks, baby ointment. Okay. Directions. Apply liberally to dry or damaged skin, lips, or nails to aid in healing. Okay. This is a very different box than what I'm used to getting. So, okay. This is going to come in handy. I am positive. So, that'll be... Okay. Okay, this... Uh, Grace and Stella hydraulic hyaluronic acid. I got this in FabFitFun and I got sent two FabFitFun boxes on accident and so I already gave one of these away so I'm probably gonna give this to somebody else. I think I need to put together a box of stuff to bring to work and be like hey guys have at it because you know I love my subscriptions, but sometimes there's just stuff I don't use. I might just make a Facebook post and I'd be like, who wants this? And yeah, oh, okay. And then, oh, the PM PMD cleaner, yes. Oh, I love the color. I was like really hoping, really hoping for this color. So this is supposed to like help clean your skin and stuff, like with the way it vibrates or something. I kind of wanted to try it. I would like to try anything that will keep me looking young-ish. Because I know I'm no spring chicken. But I want to look as much like a spring chicken as I can without plastic surgery. Because sooner or later I'm going to call Dr. Will to deal with. Yeah. And then the last item is one I've been waiting for. This is like one of the things I was really waiting for with this box. I was like excited for it. Is I have the West Elm tie dye indigo bowls from FabFitFun, and they're sitting on my coffee table. We use them for candies and stuff like that. So I was really looking for it. Sometimes we have more than three candies because we're sugar addicts obviously and you know sometimes you just want to have something else out so if I can open this and not break my nails because I already broke a nail at work yesterday and these are fake nails and I broke it so let's see oh Ooh, yes okay yes so nesting bowls these are way bigger than the West Elm. They're, they've got these different color combos on the outside. And they're colorful inside, so yes. Okay, I might have to rearrange the candies later. And, ugh. Perfect! Okay. So. Do I think this box was worth the wait? I want to say no. I think the fact that it just took so long 
really kind of killed it for me. Um, I don't think I'm going to get a fall box. I got to go figure out how to not get charged for one. So, yeah. Um, I'm really, really excited about the FabFitFun fall box. Everything I've seen from Cosbox for the fall, I wasn't feeling. Maybe I need to go look at what the other spoilers are. I've only seen a couple. Maybe I need to go look at Michelle, Mikhail, Chansey's video or something, but... I don't know. It's... I... I feel like the weight is really what killed it, because it took forever. Like, if I ordered it in May, and then it's like mid-August, and it finally arrives, and I felt like I had to pro poke them to get it, that's kind of iffy for me. Um, yeah. But, I'm happy with what I got. It's just, I mean, I know we're in the middle of a pandemic. Like, I know things are not easy to get, but I feel like every other subscription box I do, which is Maniology, Mint Mongoose, BoxyCharm, FabFitFun, and books and Bubbles and Books, and none of them have had the weight that this has had, and I'm kind of like, ugh. So, that, that really turned me off. I have to really think if I want to spend another, like, what, 60 bucks? It's like $54.99 or something. So, yeah. I don't know. You guys, let me know. Should I get the Fall Cause Box or not? Because I'm kind of torn. Like, do I give them another chance or not? So, let me know. And you guys check out the podcast, and I will see you guys later. Bye!